on the air, and you know what? I bet you don't care. I'm Brandon <laughs> from the SAS Snack Time Appreciation Society, along with the Heel Will Mahoney. We're going old school. Snack time, Hallie. We are going very old school. A lunchbox favorite, a favorite of mine from back in the day that I have not had in oh so long. This is one I am very much looking forward to. I have not even seen these in decades. Mm. I, don't, I don't know where they've been, if they've been hiding, if they've been in limited distribution, they, regional. They've uh, been around. I know they are across the street of the team. Uh, I see them all the time. I just have not had one in ever. They are from Little Debbie, of course, and they are the Star Crunch. Now let's hold on right there and just take it all the way to where it needs to go. It's not just Star Crunch. It's Star Crunch. <laughs> Which are cosmic <laughs> snacks, apparently. I don't know why they're cosmic. Is it a cosmic cookie like uh, Kevin Sullivan in the Purple Haze might have ate back in the day? Oh, <laughs> Lady of the Third Eye. Who, Who knows? knows? Who knows? Ma Maya Singh or Maha Singh in them. Makin Singh. Yeah. All that kind of deal. Now, let's, let's break down what the Star Crunch is. These it's have a, been around forever and a day. It's a hamburger patty. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. They're just as got a Thank you, God. Were they always this big? I think so. This, no, these are. They weren't always that big. No, no. I want to say I remember them being smaller. Yeah, they were a little bit smaller. They didn't get downsides. Are actually bigger. So basically, what you have here is crisp, well, crispy rice, mm -hmm. just like a rice krispies with chocolate. And I think there's caramel in there. Caramel. It's like, or is it marshmallow? No, it's not marshmallow. Either. So it's not like a s'mores. Mm -hmm. No, I think it's caramel. Caramel, it's in there. Yeah, there's corn syrup, of course, bleach flour. There's no really like, good description of what yeah, the I don't think the Yeah, I don't think the chemical breakdown is going to tell yeah. you much. There's a whole <laughs> lot of chemicals in them. I just know as a kid, I loved these. These were one of my favorites in the lunchbox. It smells extremely chocolatey. Oh, yes. Very over chocolatey. I remember being very hard, very gooey. The texture kind on these is basically where it's at. Kind of like a race there we go. treat kind of deal. Looks like a hamburger patty, basically, or a bunch of maggots dipped in chocolate. <laughs> They're described as a, a chocolate caramel and crisp rice snack. Okay, there you go. So caramel, caramel's a, and there is a caramel smell to it. It's definitely bigger than I remember. Props to Little Debbie for like increasing of size instead of downsizing. Exactly. That's right. Exactly. That's, now that's a point in the right direction. Well, no, because that's a, a recent uh, phenomenon is decreasing the size of servings and things like that just as a way of cheating to make your Ooh, packaging man. a little smaller. And it's not as hard as I remember. I remember these get hard. There's probably they do over time. They get dried out. That's what she said. But <laughs> basically, these are really, really melty chocolate on the outside. Looks like a layer of caramel in between all the little rice crispy dealios. Mm -hmm. Smells really chocolatey. There's nothing left to do but to try it out. Gooey, gooey and chewy. Really chewy. Mm -hmm. I remember loving about them. Mm -hmm. Was there a chomp factor to it? A little bit of a chomp. A little, little bit of a crunch, a little bit of a chomp. That's right. Oh, the Ryback just got kicked in the face. Mm, the Rybacks. Oh, power bar? No. Or not. My thing with these is, for some reason as a kid, I always imagined back in the day, for all you old wrestling fans, I always thought there should be a tie-in with these in WWF. I don't know why, but back when they used to do the promotional consideration, paid for by the following. I always saw these as a sponsor, just because for some reason I could see Vince McMahon promoting these and talking about Star Crunch. Double Dragon 2. What Double Crunch. <laughs> exactly. Thanks for the, uh, the uh, put in there, Steve, absolutely. <laughs> um, basically, you know, I think that uh, he could have been a tie-in with Max Moon. Yes. Exactly. He's got lasers. and he's Star Crunch stuff. cakes or something, yeah. He could have been throwing them out, throwing exactly. out the ring, passing out the kids. Launching them out of his wrist. Would have been very family friendly, man. Mm -hmm. And, um, okay, so in terms of the flavor, very chewy. Very, very chocolatey. Very chocolatey, very caramelly. Mm -hmm. The rice is there, very crispy. Like it a lot. Yeah. Um, but it has the overwhelming, prevailing flavor of cheap. Yeah. Yeah. It does taste like inexpensive goods. Mm -hmm. So that gives a little bit of a kickback. Mm -hmm. So not a full thumb up, but three quarter thumbs up for me. It's very 7 Eleven. Yeah. It is what it is. Yeah. Um, $3.99 for 12 of them. Great deal. Yeah. It's very much a convenience store kind of snack. I remember having these in the lunchbox back in the day. And I haven't had one in years. They've been around. It's like they've gone away. I've seen these around forever. So. Boat Alice go over? Uh, I think no, yeah. Oh, okay. Something or something. So anyway. Yeah, I've always really liked these. 
I'm so shocked that they're bigger than I remember. That is just such a huge plus. I have a soft spot in my heart for these, so I gotta go there. Full thumbs up. I love me some little Debbie Star Crunch, or as like Star Crunch, as it would have been called. That's right. In 1991, WWF. Without a doubt. <laughs> Thanks for watching, Snack Breeze. Thanks for picking these up for us, Dr. Jeff Smith. Yeah. You. <laughs> and you need to join the SAS by clicking on the link down below. Uh, also, uh, follow us on Twitter at Brandon Rick SAS, at Heel Will Mahoney, mm -hmm. at Brick in the SAS, at Count Duckula 21, hashtag. Hashtag Snack Society all day, every day. Get yourself some Star Crunch. In the meantime, in between time, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye. Just remember to believe.